110 days. That's how long 40 year old Sheena Gibbs has been missing from Chicago. She was last seen here in Rogers Park where she lives. Now more than three months later, her family still hasn't heard from or seen her. We're obviously distraught. This is not like her. Sheena's cousin Chris Dixon says they last spoke with her on November 3rd. She was supposed to drive to Davenport, Iowa to care for her mother who was in the hospital, but she never arrived. Before her disappearance, she was in regular contact with her family and, and we have not heard anything from her since then. Um, and so it's obviously very disturbing. We are very, very concerned. A Northwestern grad, cancer survivor, social justice activist, and home health aide, Sheena most recently worked at the University of Illinois Chicago, performing COVID test scheduling. Her last known location, according to police, was near Greenleaf and Sheridan. Black and brown women and children are underserved, overlooked, and ignored. We've got to turn that around, and it starts with Sheena Gibbs. Bishop Tavis Grant with the Rainbow Push Coalition is joining the search, raising awareness about the case and the issue, he says, of black women missing at alarming rates in Chicago. We have any number of stories, particularly from the west to the south side, of young people who are still missing, middle-aged people who are still missing, and an overwhelming number of them are black and brown women. Uh, who are heads of households, who are college students, who are entrepreneurs. But I just ask people to think about if it was your loved one, what would you do? Um, you would want somebody to come forward with information, and so that's just what we're asking people to do the same for us. In Rogers Park, Stephanie Wade, ABC7 Eyewitness News.